just digging in, digging in. I'm gonna just hold this trigger point for a little bit. Hello? Mom? It's my mother. Mom, I can't talk right now. I'm on the video. Working on Ruby, the dog. It's my mother. some goals one goal is you have to pretend you love me um, oh. and even if you don't you just have to pretend you do because that's kind of the persona we've created right that's our roles right you're in love with your chiropractor and I love you and you have to pretend again so that's one thing we have to do and then the others we're gonna work hard on your hips today mm -hmm. okay we're gonna work hard and you're gonna stay focused which is very hard for you you have to focus all right? All right, so let's look and talk to everybody. Look over here. Okay, there we go. We're gonna just say hello, the two of us, a happy couple. Here's a happy couple. Big smile, come on, big smile. Happy couple, happy couple. All right, you ready to work? All right, let's check. I'm gonna, I know we're always checking your atlas, but that's what I like to do. And actually the space, who is your chiropractor? Because whoever is taking care of your atlas I noticed that a wonderful job. she's not as hot in her head. Who isn't? Ruby. Ruby? You know, if you feel her head, it used to be very hot. It used to be warm. And now it's like a normal temperature. Wow. Could you fry an egg on that forehead? It was pretty hot. It must have been quite painful. So I'm on the atlas now. I'm holding the wings of the atlas and just twisting them a little bit in a good way. Just to see what she thinks of that. And my thumbs are under the occiput. And there's actually a muscle knot here on the, on the left occipital ridge that I don't like. So I'm gonna work into that. I'm gonna massage that for a little bit. You're gonna to have to hang in there. All right. And I'm digging my thumb at the edge of the occiput and the edge of the atlas. So I'm in that pole area that you love. You're like a little horse anyway, right? In a good way. And I'm working that. Let me just see if the other one, the other one's normal. Let me do this a little bit of a lift, okay? So I'm going to come under here. And <clears throat> one more. Got it. All right, there's the space I wanted. What do you think of that? Did you like that? Should we keep working? I didn't really ask formally. Would you let me give you a carpeting adjustment today? All right, listen. That was a big yes. All right, you know, people are watching. Okay, control yourself. You see that? Oh, you get a shake on that. You get a shake just because you like knocking me over. All right, so we did the occiput already. Do you see the hazards that I have to put up with? A lot of people are worried when I'm working with horses, I'm gonna get kicked. Is anybody worried that when I'm working with a Rottweiler, they're gonna knock me over with kisses? Now, why are you like this? Okay, we were supposed to check your spine. We're not, supposed, we're not supposed to do this yet. This is not on the schedule to get the chest rub and the belly rub and the abdominal scratchies. Okay, give it a scratch we're time. We're supposed to do this at the end of a session. Okay, what do you think of this? Do you like this? Is this what you drove all the way over to see for? She's like, I don't even care about the adjustment. I just want all the good moves. All right. All right, now, look at your wrist. Didn't we find one that wasn't moving so well? That one moves well. Remember, we found this front one. Yeah, this one doesn't move well. So I'm on this front paw, and this one. Good. 
working in here. Got it. Okay, look at that. Don't freak out. I'm almost done. There we go. Ooh, cracked. Each little finger, a little flangey. Let's check this one now. When we got out of the car, she was running here. She was? Yeah, dragging me. She knew where she, she was. was. She likes coming to see me. Let's get these little fingers, little flangies. Okay, what if I do this for a minute? Do you like that too? Let's see your face. Your eyeballs, open your eyes. Big, big eyes. There you go. There you go. Good going. I'm gonna scratch your neck now. Yes, 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 yes. Mm. Mm. All right. All right, coming down the back. So here we are. I'm on C3 right now on the left side. There's a muscle knot here, so I'm going to work that out for a minute. I'm going to massage it and dig into that trigger point. This is tender here. Not for me, for her. I know you're wondering who, but for her it would be tender because it's her trigger point, right? All right, you're pushing me away. This could be a thumbnail picture, I think, right here, don't you think? All right, listen. I'm up on your neck now. Now I'm in the withers, T3 through T8. We don't call them withers on a dog, but I call them whatever I feel like calling. And I'm coming down the back now. And she's, I think she's enjoying this. It's hard to tell. All right, come back this way. Let's go into the back. Now I'm pushing pretty hard in here. Okay, that was, Lower thoracics, lay back down, there's more. Ooh, did you yeah, hear that crack? That, one, yeah. that was a loud crack. That might have been the loudest one I ever heard on you. That got me excited. I got a really good angle, that's a good thing right now. Ooh, I hope that helps you. Mm. Ooh, bless you. That's a reaction, right? I don't know if it's a normal reaction. Now I'm down at the sacrum. <clears throat> Ooh, another one. Oh my God, let's pedal your legs. <laughs> that wasn't good, I freaked you out. All right, come over here, let's do your... All right, excuse us for a second. Just give us a private moment. Just, just a private moment. All right, okay. Just a little private time for us. All right, all right, back, we're back. All right, we were just spooning for a minute. All right, so I got a good thoracic, thoracolumbar junction adjustment. We are working, I know you don't think I'm working, but I am working on her. And now I'm in the, the right hip, which is her good hip, comparatively, because she doesn't have damage on this hip. And this is the bad leg and the bad pad. Okay, now I'm on the hip. We're gonna do some stretching, okay? I think I'm gonna put my leg over like I've done before. All right. All right, look, my shoelace is on time. You should have reminded me. All right, here we go. So we're gonna stretch now. Mm. There you go. It gets tight. Between every visit, it gets really tight. Oh, uh, there you go. There you go. Okay. Oh. So what I'm feeling, my hand is pushing it at the top of her femur. Um, I'm up top. And I, as I traction out, I'm stretching and extending. Almost like I'm doing like this. Here, stay there for a second. So I'm pushing in here and I'm stretching that leg up. But she doesn't get great extension like I do. But I'm pushing here first. So I'm pushing and yanking that leg up. All right, you can make fun of me in the comments, I know. 
But come on back here. Hey, but that's what I'm doing. And hers is pretty rigid, you know? Like, this is, you know, work, work, work. It's work in progress. I don't know if she stretches as much as I do, but we're stretching her today. Boop. Oh, that cl just clicked. Did you hear your hip click? Yeah. Put your head down. Put your head down. Boop. She does do a stretch now when she gets Boop. out of bed. She gets and does yeah. it like a doggy yoga stretch. Yeah. All right, come on, give me, this, give me this leg. I'm gonna go back to work. There you go, that's what I want to see. Come on, you can do it. Everybody take a breath, Meek included. Ruby, take a breath. Put your head down. All right. Now my nose itches. That's what I want to see. Look, beautiful. Bring that leg up. Bring the leg up. Bring, oh, let's bring it this way. Let's see what happens this way. Okay. Okay. Nice, look at that, not bad. Bring it this way. So this is where it's tricky because she, she's got that jerking reflex pulling against this. But you know, legs are meant to go both directions. There you go. And hers does eventually. Okay. I'm using my leg as a little fulcrum point. There you go. Good, good, good. That's a nice stretch. Everybody say, way to go, Ruby. Good stretch. Way to go, Ruby. That's it. Look, that's beautiful extension. Even her head is extended. We're stretching this whole anterior line. Okay, we'll do one more if you let me, okay? What do you think? One more? Take a breath. Okay, let's bring that leg out. Bring it out. Ooh, did you hear it click? It just cracked. Hope you can hear that. What? While I'm here, I might do a little abduction. Let's pull this out sideways. I know this is exposing you the way you might not want to be exposed on YouTube, but I'm actually pulling the whole leg out to the side. So do I need to do it for everybody? So I'm pulling the leg out this way. So it's tucked in and pulling it out that way. Can you see me, what I'm doing? Pulling it out that way. Good, that helps. Boop. All right, nobody look. Nice. I know this is taking time, but you probably haven't made it this far in the playlist of Ruby if you know we're in a rush because we don't go fast because she's nine years old and she's got a lot of aches and pains but she's doing so well now right she's so some of the well. things some of the let's review some of the things she's doing now you know since we started for years she didn't really hop up on the couch right no she would climb up yeah now she can literally now just she jumps, she and just and jumps right up, up and I've been calling her the old Rottweiler, which I need to change because she's running around like a young one. She also goes into the backyard, breaks through the bushes, runs through the neighbor's yard, and she even ran into someone's house. Right into the house yeah. And this is a dog that never left her bed for years, or goes from the bed to the kitchen, the bed to the kitchen, the bed to the kitchen, and now she goes on these walkabouts where you feel like you have to walk around the whole village. Right? She, yeah, she's been escaping and a lot. I she escapes, the and then she has to explore and get into mischief and be a bad girl, right? You're getting into naughty behavior and getting into trouble like you used to when you were a youngin'. So now watch this. I don't know if you guys can see, but the tip of my elbow is into her hip. Okay, this is intense, so she might not let me do this. So I'm prying this back 
digging my elbow in to the hip muscles and this doesn't feel good for her. Boop. And uh, just digging in, digging in. I'm gonna just hold this trigger point for a little bit. Hello? Mom? It's my mother. Mom, I can't talk right now. I'm on the video I'm working on Ruby, the dog. It's my mother. Shh. All right, I'll talk to you later. That was my mother. She says hello. All right, so that part's done. So now we're going to move on to the other hip. I'm putting a lot of downward pressure right now. That's good. You're going to spin around now. Do you want to shake it out first? We'll do a little shake. She's going to get out. Hopefully she'll shake. Come on, get up and shake. Come on. I told you you're really going to shake. No shaking? There we go. Little delay, but it still counts. Very good. Here, sit. High five. Good work so far? Great. Should we do the bad hip now? All right, let's do the other hip. All right, which is the other hip? It's the right hip. Left hip. Yes, we have to do the left hip. So where's your left? I'm so bad at left and right. All right. Left hip. Not many Rottweilers will let you <laughs> drag them around like that. No. And still give you a kiss. Yes, and I get a kiss out of the deal. Oh, put your head down. Boop. Boop. All right, so now my thumb, boop, my thumb is on, put your head down, boop. My thumb is on a really bad trigger point right here at the top of the femoral head. That's where the thigh bone has a little ball that sticks into the hip socket, and ball and socket, right? Oh, come on, you have to behave yourself. Get back down. Yeah. All right, so the ball, the top of the femur has a ball on it and it goes into the hip socket. And right now I'm in that little hip socket. Now I'm going to start with the abduction. She has pretty good abduction here. Okay. And I'm going to just hold the stretch. So I'm at the end point of the stretch where it starts to hit resistance. And now I'm going to keep pulling. My thumb is in the socket at the same time, which is not pleasant. But it's really good because I'm working the muscles. So by adducting the hip and bringing it, splaying it out like this, I can go underneath and you can see this is where I'm starting, but I can't even penetrate until I adduct. As I adduct, there it comes here. Watch this, get closer with the video if you can. Bring the video over. So here there's nothing, but watch. As it comes up, my thumb disappears. Get even and closer. Can you crawl over with the camera? So here, look, I'm on the surface. And as I bring this back up, the thumb penetrates into the socket deeper, deeper, deeper until my thumb is buried. You can't even see the first inch and a half of my thumb, you know, or four, four centimeters. Four centimeters is buried in that socket now. And I'm going to pull it further. My thumb goes deeper. My thumb goes deeper. My thumb goes deeper, and I almost have six centimeters of my thumb in there now. And so, it's really in there. Now watch, as I peel it back out, you'll see where my thumb was the whole time. There it is. And let's put it back in. And take it out. I'm only doing this part so you guys can see because I really want to keep that thumb buried in there. As I adduct, abduct, no, abduct, AB. I was confused the two. But AB duct, abduct to pull away from center line, and adduct, ADD, UCTOR, adduction or adductor, brings it towards the midline. And now I'm going to extend from here. So my thumb's in here. We're in adduction, and we're going to go for thigh extension. And we're going to bring that leg up. And there you go. There's a fly on me. Get back. Put your head down. We're still working. No kissing. We'll do that later. OK. 
Okay, and now I'm going to stretch this straight. All right, stretching straight. There you go. I'm leveraging. I don't know if you can see, but my arm is into my own leg. So I'm creating mechanical advantage to get more leverage and get to do a stronger job while I'm working. I'm always looking at my own body positions so that I can make the most of it. She's breathing hard. This is not easy. I'm, I mean, not easy for me. Not easy for her either. And I'm trying to get more stretch, more lengthening, bringing that leg up. Hmm? My nose itches. Sorry, everyone. But I just itched my nose. All right. Still coming up. A little more. Let's lift up. Everybody take a breath in. Whew. Oh, a little more. A little more. A little more. Okay. Shake that loose, baby. Shake that loose. Shake it, baby. Shake it loose. Shake it, baby. Shake it loose. Shake it, baby. Shake it loose. Shake it, shake it, shake it. Shake it, baby. Shake it loose. All right, almost done. We're gonna work into the bottom part of the joint. All right, you wanna walk around for a minute? All right. Come over here. Come on over here. Shake. Good. Let's go back to that back leg. Here, you can see her back leg from here. Here, can you see how it's bent to the side? That's from her injury. out of this joint because it's calcified. It's like new bone in here over the years. I'm trying to maximize what I can get, but this is definitely grew this way now. It's You can hear little crackles when I move this. So right through here is a joint and I'm moving this back and forth. and. Again, I'm holding things, so I stabilize below the joint and wiggle it above. Put your head down, boop, and uh, working this back and forth. And then I'm coming below. Be so good if you could just crack it back into place, but we can't do that. All right. Okay, I'm just wiggling that whole hip out. Look at this, everybody. Put your head down, this is so good for you. All right, wiggling it, wiggling it, wiggling it, wiggling it. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. I just drooled. Did you see me drool? Wiggle, 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 wiggle. All right, all right. There you go, there you go. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Put your head down. Wiggle, wiggle. Mm. Wiggle, wiggle. Mm. All right, that part's done. Let's check your TMJ. All right, what do you think? All right, let's look at your little jaw. Let's look at your jaw. All right, all right. May I look at your jaw? Can you stop that? Control yourself. Remember we had that talk about you controlling yourself? Okay, okay, I'm on the jaw. That one's fine. Yeah, this one, I think it's the right side today. Remember? Got it. Stabilize your little face. Mm. Ooh, that made a little pop too. Did you hear that? All right, let's open up. Ready? All right. Okay. All right. 
I'm sweating. I'm exhausted. You made me work so hard. Ah. Okay, I'm gonna bite you now. Ah. 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 All right. Get that hair in my mouth. I just bit you. I bit you like a dog. All right, and the chest feels good. I think we're done. All right. Are we done? Tell everybody how good you feel. I feel so good. I feel so good. Because I'm the greatest chiropractor. His name is Dr. Dog. I love Dr. Dog. All right. Thanks, everybody. Just digging in, digging in. I'm going to just hold this trigger point for a little bit. Hello? Mom? It's my mother. Mom, I can't talk right now. I'm on the 